<laughs> Guess who? Hi, Venom. What is, ladies and gentlemen? I am excited today. I swear to God, there's not something 100% Colombian flowing through me. But to be honest, ladies and gentlemen, I found a YouTuber that commits uh, crimes on camera. <laughs> oh, now I know that's a big statement to be saying, but I really don't know what to glean from what I've just seen. Now, to understand, uh, a few days ago, uh, before I flew out, uh, we made a video where we looked at iShow speeds like crypto uh, shenaniganders. And uh, the people behind it, Paradox Multiverse, specifically, I think the leader, the the, the person behind the project, uh, uh, Amio Talio, was the character that uh, we kind of all like uh, sort of looked at with a little bit of a questions. Now, the thing about it is this guy would relatively be unknown, all right? But because he brought big celebrities like I Show Speed on into the entire mix, somebody that's immediately recognizable on YouTube, everyone immediately started looking into this guy. <laughs> so ladies and gentlemen, today I want to show you a few snippets, a few little pieces, a few goofs and gaffs that might leave you with your mouth wide wide open. Now, ladies and gentlemen, what did this person do right after, uh, you know, getting exposed and sort of like ha having the spotlight put onto them? Well, they made a truth behind Paradox Crypto scam. Okay, let's open this Is one up. Is Paradox Crypto a scam? I'm going to talk about what's happened over the last few days and you guys can make your own decision. We want... Well, can we comment? Oh, they're turned off! <laughs> oh, God damn! So I always like it when uh, they, they make these videos, the truth behind it. And of course, the comments just have to be turned off. Likes have to be turned off. Dislikes are already taken care of. From what I've understood, this video is very boring. If you wanted to go check out a funny video out of it, go check out Moist Critical or actually just, just watch this one, okay? Fig you know, figure it out for yourself, okay? Fact check for yourself. Now, because of this, this person has an entire YouTube channel, around 7,700 and... 7,780 subscribers, okay? Mine's kind of fried. Now, you got one YouTube short with speed, but then, of course, when you go to the video section, you realize this person was about to make some content. Content and vlogs a year ago. So, of course, made one video called They Stole 600,000 Pounds, No Clickbait. So, let's see what the gangbangers of Hogwarts are about to do, ladies and gentlemen. Let's dive right in. We was going to do a video shoot today for Amiotali University. And, uh, got all my Whoa, you have a university? Wait, let me check this out. Oh, damn, dude, he's got... Man, this guy, this guy, this guy's amazing. Unlock your potential. Listen to me and I will make you rich. <laughs> Wait, what? Become a member? Hold on. What's the number one most important thing for you to focus on? We will teach you NFTs, pre-sales, crypto and blockchain, crypto coins to buy, day trading, stock market investments. Boy, I really hope you're not a financial advisor here. Let me see this. Man, there's really, like, not really a disclaimer I'm reading over here. Jesus Christ. We will email you further information to access all the content as well as our Discord server. Oh, dude, stay far away. Uh, what is this? How am I going to get you rich? The one thing you can't afford not to be a part of. Well, you can't really, it's the wrong of. With Ami Otalio as your personal mentor 24-7 and the full support of the AT University team, uh, you will finally reach your potential. Professionals at the top of their game train every day and their lifestyles reflect that. Are you ready to become a real businessman? From running small business to owning multi-million dollar companies, Ami will use the same blueprint for each. Anytime you just see the Lamborghini and all the flex going on, run real far away. You know, this is the only thing where I swear to God, I, I'm not even kidding with you. The Andrew Tate, like, hustler crap makes more legitimacy than this, all right? At least he had a Bugatti, not some Lamborghini, okay? It's like a Honda Civic for a lot of these people these days. Let's get back in. Hey, you know what? One second. One second. Okay, he gets out of the car here. Nice, nice. All right, let's go. They're parking up behind the Lambo. Open He's in some neighborhood. Open the boot. Open the boot. Oh, so you see, see right over here, audience, okay? That is a delivery bot, okay? It says, hungry, I can help. That's someone's dinner, bro. <laughs> That's low. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> all right, what's he going to do? He's going to grab the bot here? I hate robots. All right, that's, that's great to know. Evidently, you do. <laughs> There's no way this is real. He made this order. He ordered that. That's an order that he made that's going on the road. There's no way. I got I'm giving Listen, him the benefit. Don't record me, help me. Come help me. Maybe maybe like take it out and insert all the wheels in for what am I doing? This is a bullshit video anyways. Now of course you might be wondering, oh dang, Muda, what happened? Obviously it's gotta be fake, right? Well, that's what I'm wondering until there's some people that walk outside and start questioning the actual brain damage going on here. Let's see this. See if it fits. Why? What's up? 
What's that? Sorry again? Hey, what's yours? Oh, is it delivering to you? We're here to deliver to you. We're here to bring it to you. Look. Bruh, you just recorded yourself grabbing his delivery. What's wrong with you? And you posted it. Come on. <laughs> Have you got COVID? Well, you want to stand there and I'll deliver it to you. All right, come on. Do you want to... They're actually like not even in on it. Look at like the faces of these people. They're like, uh, honey, should we call the local PD? Something's going on here. <laughs> okay. Two feet away, six feet away, yeah. Um, can I see the app? Make sure it's you, really, you guys. Starship. Starship, yeah, that's it. That's this. Let me just, uh, we got caught. We are the worst. We are the worst criminals ever. <laughs> Bro, you can say that again. God damn. They actually left that part in and drove off. I'm actually kind of questioning reality right now. Like, I'm getting a bit of whiplash going on. But obviously, ladies and gentlemen, that's a, that's a little funny. Okay, that's a, that's a little bit of goofy nonsense going on. I guess so. What we just witnessed was an actual crime happening on, on camera. Okay, um, interesting. All right, the fact that he posted that, you know, it's... That's all I'm going to leave it at, ladies and gentlemen. Goddamn. Now, of course, well, I could probably, like, laugh at that. Honestly, just that alone wouldn't be video worthy to me. Where it gets really criminal is this guy and his communication with actual, uh, you know, other people that have called him out recently because of the Paradox situation. So here's a video by ODR, a channel with 12,000 subscribers. Now, of course, they made this video, Amio Talia Exposed. Paradox Metaverse Crypto Scam, Paradox Token Owner Sends Threats for No Reason. Let's listen Paradox to this Paradox Crypto, you guys are buying a token from this guy. Yes, I'll play the messages. Okay. See you, you little shit. I'm gonna come see you personally myself. Yeah, for spreading all that fake lies on my name, you little bastard. Watch when I catch you, I'm gonna smash your teeth in. Every single time you look at your face in the mirror, you're gonna see your broke up nose bus up in 20 different places ah the real internet tough guy clyde cash shit i swear to god every time like a uk person talks like this it's never actually threatening it always just comes across as hilarious no disrespect i'm just saying what it is okay all right the gangbangers of hogwarts have their limitations that's what i'm gonna do that big those are yours right you thought it was funny that you thought it's funny you can just troll man's on the internet oh i'm not an internet guy what you see on the internet is one thing <laughs> He's actually calling him while the dude's listening to the threat. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Not now. Let me finish the threat first. Put your name out, right? I'm gonna screenshot your your username right now. I'm gonna put ten bags down for anyone that shows me this guy's address, right? Shows me this guy's address. I'll give him ten bags. Watch how your own boys will snitch on you and give me your address. And I'm gonna see what you're gonna say when I come there. Cause I think you think I'm just some internet dickhead, but I'm not an internet dickhead. Yeah? So I'll see you very soon, you little shit. And one lesson you're gonna learn from this. Don't talk shit on the internet. Wait a minute. So you're gonna pay $10,000 or 10,000 pounds or whatever racks uh, to get this person's docs. And then you're going to show up there and do what? I'm pretty sure these are actual physical threats. These are actual threats, and this person should take this to the local police, get a restraining order, and at least get some form of protection. This is wrong. Because you chat shit, you get banged. End off. And I'll make sure personally every mother... I beg you try and screenshot this and put this out there. Just do me a favor. Do me a favor. I'm going to show the whole world you can't just troll in the internet and... You can't just troll on the internet. Well, I don't think you can just give physical threats without expecting some actual repercussion. That, my friend, is not how you do it. This is literally internet tough guy shit. And uh, if you actually uh, should be... Anybody sends you stuff like this, go to the cops. Get it sorted out. These people literally only have that recourse. Stop entertaining them. 
Now, of course, I wanted to look at the history of this person and I wanted to see, man, is this guy like just maybe this was an off day? Maybe this is like a mental breakdown. Who knows? So then I looked at a video from 10 months ago, which is so haram, it got banned off of community guidelines. Like, sorry, not banned. It got age restricted, meaning that it's whatever's in it is a little too juicy for the average population. So what we're going to do is we're going to just log in and we're going to watch it together. Okay, there's some key fundamentals here. No way, dude. It's like it's out of r slash narco footage. Just stop it. I told you lot. I ain't here for clout. I lose my clout, no problem. I told you man ain't here for no clout. But my man why try violate me on the Instagram lives. Uh, yo, down and down try, down. Insta try violate man. My people have landed there strapped up saying, yo, what time is it, innit? Another example of internet tough guy behavior. Well, this isn't the internet tough guy. This is like having somebody film you being a public nuisance. No, this video isn't from r slash public freakouts. Just watch oh, this. What? Look at this lun next to me. Taki, 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 taki. You're missing panga, panga kasans. Okay, so what he's saying is like, look at this penis next to me. Mese panga garunga panga fight. Like, basically, let me start some beef. On live, by the way, okay? Great, cute. What the fuck? What are you f***ing swearing? What? What are you f***ing swearing at? taking a picture of me. I'm taking a selfie of Wait, don't swear at me. Don't swear at me. Hold this one second. He's on the live. He's not talking about you. Hold on. Look at this. Second. Look at this. Can someone record this. Look at this. We want to swear at me. You're something life. Yeah. It's life. Yeah. It's life. Yeah, life. Yeah, I'm in the life. You're talking about me. Who the f talking about you? You're nobody. What are you talking about? Don't f talk to me anymore. What? Don't f stop f getting f with me now. Don't worry, you recorded this. Watch this, this is how you smack up that pussy like this. He comes over here, works out yeah. here, What? What? Don't f***ing now, bruv. Don't mind your business, go over there. Down, go over there, go over there. Quiet. Bruh, what is this man? The guy literally wasn't in the wrong. He literally wants to start a fight with him, and that's what he goes for. This man is literally unhinged, okay? Not only is this person just straight up unhinged with the... Not only is the paradox stuff shady to begin with, but now when you get the added context of this individual's behavior on YouTube for not just, like, the last week. No, this is, like, the last 10 months, up to a year even, that this person has been making an absolute dipshit out of himself. Yeah, there's a reason why people are laughing at at you bro you're an internet tough guy with nothing else going on okay you might have like an internet university crap that i guess a bunch of 12 year olds fall for but none of it is actually meaningful you're an actual nobody in the grand scheme of reality okay and that's me the fat indian guy telling you off on the internet okay if i'm doing that you know you're down bad brother that's all i'm saying now, ladies and gentlemen, when it comes down to this whole scenario when it comes down to this whole situation this is one of those youtubers that's just like Honestly, I feel that they're actually dangerous, okay? First off, I think they're actually physically dangerous. You know, forget the whole, like, stealing the, the, the hungry, like, robot card in the beginning. The fact that they're outside and, and they're literally going streaming themselves live, making public freakouts and getting angry with people randomly out on the internet, out, out in a gym, is already deranged. But when you're making actual physical threats, talking about setting up literal bounties on people... You, my friend, are not just getting into some borderline dangerous behavior, but depending on where you live, you are actually committing illegal criminal act acts, okay? And I feel like this person just hasn't gotten the slap on their wrist yet, and they haven't been, like, really publicized the way that they should. So hopefully, ladies and gentlemen, you learn to stay far away from this individual, stay far away from their university, because let me tell you something right now, okay? If this person is your mentor with how much of a child, a man-child they act like on the internet, you ain't learning shit from that university, okay? God damn. Damn. But ladies and gentlemen, this is me, Mudahar, and before I attract the wrath of the internet tough guys, I'm going to sit back, relax, play some Warzone 2, and uh, head to bed, ladies and gentlemen. This is me, Muda, and I, <laughs> oh. Woo! I am out.